Kitty was able to travel with Mom and Savannah to Boise. She spent some time with her Aunt Melinda. She had a great time playing with Megan. Kate also attended a birthday party for Maddie. They went to play at Hop To It. She had a great time playing on all of the bouncy toys. This week, Savannah went to a clogging competition in Boise, Idaho. She competed in six clogging events, Intermediate Line, Intermediate Show, Intermediate Traditional, and Intermediate Percussion, and also her team dances. She was able to score second in place in all of her events, even though, although she did not qualify for her national competition, it gave her a chance to sew her stuff in front of the judges. She knows that with a little bit of practice, she will score first place medal at Port Codella competition in March. Great job, Savannah. Andy competed in a basketball tournament in Kimberly, Idaho. He played against Minico Jerome and another team that is unknown. Andy played very well in each game and has improved his dribbling skills and passing skills. Although Andy played well, his team was only able to pull off one win. Andy isn't sure when his next tournament will be, but he is sure he will be ready to give it 100%. Cooper received a scholarship last week from Zions Bank. Each quarter, Zions Bank gives a $100 scholarship to one student that participates in Pace for A's program. Kobe was the winner this quarter, so the bank manager presented him with the scholarship over to Larry Junior High. The principal and vice principal were also in attendance and congratulated him for his hard work at getting straight A's. Kobe will be saving the scholarship money to help pay for his college tuition. Nice job, Kobe.